Hey guys, welcome back to the show. Thank you for tuning into this episode of Hooked on OC. We're here every Sunday morning, seven o'clock on WMDT TV 47. I am very, very happy to report that today's Angler's Advantage is coming to you from the deck at Atlantic Tackle. We are finally back. Here we with are. my main man, Brian Tinkler. Let's give the COVID high five, yeah, Brian. Right We're not quite there you, yeah. yet, but we will be soon <laughs> enough. Um, we're here in the new normal out there all over the place. Yep, I am, got my I mask am, going yeah, right here. Ready to go. <laughs> Hopefully I, we'll be rid of these things before too long. That's right. I am refusing to say this is the new normal. I think we're going to be back to normal sooner than later. Things are opening up all across the eastern shore and across Maryland, including Atlantic Tackle. Lots of charter boats are going now. Tuna fish are being caught. So summer is off to a really yep. great start despite what's been going on. Earliest um, white marlin ever, Earliest right? white marlin ever, yep. Boat out of Ocean Pines called the Real Escape, caught the earliest white marlin ever on May the 23rd. Right. right after that, about an hour and a half later, the Talking Trash called another white marlin. Those guys are looking at 11,000 for the first fish and then right. 5,000 for the Marlin Club fish on Talking Trash. So uh, we're off to a great start. Right. This flounder fishing right out here is outstanding. Uh, so basically, all things are normal other than as normal as they could be right, right now. We're so happy. We, we know what the grizzly bear feels like when he comes out of hibernation. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, he felt like what he knows yeah. when he's sleeping all the time. I think, I think the grizzly comes out skinny. I think he we might. maybe, yeah. Judging from our host's black shirt on there, he's maybe trying to hide about it. They told me it's slimming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they told me it's slimming. Oh, uh, that's awesome. But it's really nice to be able to go back into the building here. Yep. Michelle's got new staff and the place is looking really, really good. Um, you guys have some special restrictions like everybody across the we state. We do at the have, moment. As you know, as we're airing right now, we have restrictions on the number of people in the building we have to monitor. Yep. And uh, of course everyone needs face covering, both our staff and our customers in the building yep. need face covering. So uh, and I'm pretty confident that you know, by the time we get to Father's Day weekend, we're probably still going to have some of those restrictions, at least face covering in place and stuff. Um, so we'll monitor that, honor the governor's wishes, yep. and do our best to provide everybody uh, with the gear they need to get out there and do social distancing Ocean City style. That's right. All 60 things, miles off the beach. <laughs> right. You don't need to worry about social yeah. distancing out there. All things are pointing in the direction of this getting better and not worse. So I don't expect any restrictions to be more uh, you that's, know, yeah, that's what more we're than they for, are yeah. now, um, but you never know. But I think things are going to start easing up even more than they are right now, and it's nice to be able to go in there and at least put your hands on things and shop, yeah. walk right up to the counter and buy them rather than the curbside and things you guys had to go through. You can um, really feel the energy and enthusiasm yeah. people have, uh, you know, to get out and about, but really to get on their boat, get out and go fishing, which is it's kind of funny because most people really wouldn't even have just begun to fish and everything, but. Something about the fact that they've been told that they can't fish they for the last two months anyway. uh, makes <laughs> yep. them want to get out there that much more. Yep. We've got some good news on the tournament front, too. You know, the Ocean City Tuna Tournament is on, the Marlin Club Tournaments are on, White Marlin Open is all Absolutely. on. Absolutely. We'll see what restrictions they have to have in place yep. as far it as spectators are It may look a little different, yep. uh, but yep. they'll be an event and we'll be giving away some some big checks. Absolutely so that's, right. Uh, that's something to look forward to as well. And most of those events you'll be able to see online, too. You know, we'll, Dave and I will be doing the live stream right. for the Tuna Tournament Mid-Atlantic. Uh, white marlin open absolutely all so we'll be good uh, speaking of father's day you brought up you got some really great stuff here for for wife yeah. son daughter grandparent whatever that wants to nothing like that dad. dad yeah dad's and dad. what a day <laughs> for dad huh? the that's rest of the family can get out of the house yeah. go away maybe that's for exactly a little while right. get a little bit exactly right. a little bit of me time for dad yep um, michelle's put together an amazing collection uh, of offerings here at the store for dad everything from you know some really cool apparel and everything straight through to fishing gear professional fishing gear and right through the tackle yeah. rods and reels terminal tackle you name it we've got it sunglasses and everything and we'll we'll feature a couple of these things here but anybody that's uh, looking for a great gift idea for dad come to Atlantic Tackle and you will find something that uh, that he's gonna really enjoy having and there's something for every budget too so mom if you got a young kid out there and wants to spend 10 bucks on something They've got something here that dad's going to be happy with and you've got some several hundred bucks you want to send get some really great deer for dad's offshore career they've got that as well right let's just go around the table man and talk about some absolutely stuff out here uh we, we start with these uh fishing boots we've got an amazing selection from uh grundins pelagic and hook uh you know there nobody has the type of offerings that michelle has in the right. store typically you wander into a store and there might be one of these brands in there or something but She's got an amazing selection and, and uh, you know, a deep inventory in all of them in sizes. 
So uh, chances are you'll find something that, that you like the look of and, and it'll be available in your size in, in one of these waterproof boots. And in the different colors, you know, the pelagic, uh, the pursuit deck boot, the hook boot, they come in different styles right. and colors, men's and Absolutely. ladies, she's got it all upstairs. And for anybody that's not familiar with them, these, these boots are all designed for deck surfaces yeah. and everything. So these aren't your, uh, your big box store rubber boots that you might find or anything. These bo boots are designed for the fishing enthusiast to be, enthusiast to be on the boat and uh, have good fit footing while they're on the boat. Right on, yep. Loadout box by Yeti has uh, been a popular one in here. Yeti's yeah. kind of taken over the market on coolers and stuff like that, but they're also doing some accessories that are really yeah, cool. Yeah, and you know, anybody that's uh, fishing in a in one of the big center consoles or or uh, any boat that's, you know, prone to taking a little water, yep. or a little splash here and there, these things are fantastic. They're basically indestructible. This looks uh, like one of our camera cases, it, honestly. It, exactly. It's built with the same type yep. of... Uh, of technology and everything. It's it's super durable, waterproof, great place to put your belongings, yep. checkbook, wallet, you know, phone and everything, you button that up got in different there. trays yep. that go in, dividers, different uh, pockets and accessory compartments right. inside, really great product. These have been super popular. Michelle has a great stock of them here in the store. And, uh, you know, it's one of those things that might be the gift for somebody that kind of has everything. Mm -hmm. um, and it, it's, it will be valued and, you can use for any number of things uh, beyond boating. Great, right. works great in camping, uh, you know, anything like that as well. Yep, Unseen Productions might have to get one. There you go. Here you go. Look at that. One for you. The straw cap. That's Every right. dad needs one of these <laughs> these days. Look at that. That is exactly right, man. Yep. <laughs> these are available from Avid, Pelagic, yeah. and Hook. Uh, most of them have a, a print on the bottom as well. Really, really cool looking hat. Gives you the sun protection everybody needs out here. Looking good at the same time. Uh, every dad needs a straw cap. Yeah, they so look this great. It's a, a great choice. And what do they go great with? Oh yeah, Costas. <laughs> look at that. I got everybody on the water needs a pair of Costas. Whoa, these might not come off today. Oh. Ah, the Costas, amazing sunglasses. Anybody that's spent any time on the water has seen people wearing them. And if you haven't had them on, just throw a pair on and look out at the water. You will see the difference right away. Your eyes relax. You can see stuff that you would never see, particularly yep. when you're fishing in the deep. These glasses are the, the glasses to be wearing. Funny, funny story I always tell Captain Luke Bloom, and I've been friends for a long, long time. Back in the day, we were flounder fishing. He netted a fish, thought he had dropped his sunglasses over. Oh my God, my sunglasses are on my I said. Bro, they're on your face. They were literally yeah. sitting on his eyes. He was looking right through them and right. didn't realize it because they were this, the look right. was so clear going right. through the lens. Uh, all right, we've got a Black Bart special yeah. here that's going to be pretty killer, right? Michelle you got a budget you're not worried yeah, about? Yeah, awesome yep. arrangement with Black Bart. They put together these packets for us. And, um, you know, Black Bart's been in the business for a number of years. Super high quality stuff. Yes. Their gear lasts forever. Made in the USA. Yep. Made in the USA. Yep. And uh, there's, she's got an amazing selection here, and uh, you know, and these comes, are rigged too. These yeah, are, they're these, rigged these aren't and ready just you're to buying go. Yep. The, the lure, you're buying yep. the leader, you're buying the hook, you're buying it all ready to go. So if you got dad out there like trolling beaded hoochies or old green machines or something like that, you want him to step up his tune in marlin game. This is a way to do it. And Father's Day, it's all going to be in here in Atlantic Tackle. Yeah, Rod she's combo. got those Here's... in multiple sizes and everything too. Okay, so it's not just the small What stuff. you're targeting, yeah. Right on, because they make them all the way up to the big breakfast. That's which is right, that... and she's got the big breakfast okay. for the blue marlin. Right fishing. on. The pen combo. Which one we have here? The Fierce Three. Guys, you can see they've got all kinds of different pen combos inside, different color schemes, blues, pinks, reds. You're going to find them anywhere from probably 12 to 15 pound test all the way up to 40, 50 pound test. They've also got some conventional styles that are going to be right up, uh, easy to pick up here too, with the rod and the reel ready to go. How about that? Oh. That, you know. Oh, you that can't beat it. 129 bucks for that thing this out the door. This combo is 149.95. 149. This is a 15 to 25 pound combo. This would be great for inshore flounder fishing, rock fishing, you name it. Yep. Small dolphin offshore. Yep. Huge selection of apparel here at Atlantic Tackle. And these shorts. Dad shorts. Yeah, man. Dad you shorts. You got to have something. This one doesn't have it, but these do. Talk about an elastic waistband. Yeah. Waist, 
you Those coming puppies. Out of, you coming out of quarantine? Yeah. <laughs> you need a couple extra. No, I'm not yeah. buying the 38, man. Yeah. I'm not buying the 38. I'm buying the 36. Uh, yeah, they, with got, the they got about two, two inches of give in them, and they they really, you know, uh, a lot of elastic elastic waistband shorts don't fit right and everything. Yeah, no. But they have designed a short with the elastic waistband, and it's not a 100% band. It's just got a little give on either side. Yeah, just a little and bit. It, and it extends the coverage. For anybody coming out of quarantine, might be a few pounds heavier. Yep, it's a it's a great choice. Those are are uh, waterproof shorts, so when you're working in the cockpit, you know this kind of stuff goes from uh, fishing all day right to the bar without having to change. Right, most of them are going to have plier pockets on them. Yep, uh, zipper closers on the back pockets right. and stuff. And then you've got an unbelievable yeah. selection of long sleeve shirts. First and second and floor stuff. for yeah. any anybody that's looking for uh, you know. Uh, Offshore inspired oh, yep. apparel and stuff. Yep. Uh, Puck, she's Pelagic, got it all in here. Avid gear. Grunin's even got some outerwear upstairs. Right. Yeah. Got a lot of uh, Atlantic Tackle brand stuff in there oh, that's, that's right. uh, you know, local specific for anybody, especially somebody that's looking for a gift for somebody that's out of town or something. It's a great way to, uh, you know, give them a little tie to the to the local fishing community. Sure, and I'm sure while they last is gonna be in quotes here, but you guys have that Atlantic Tackle buff inside, face shield, 100 buck purchase, you get yeah, one of those yeah, free the or $10. The beautiful thing about the the hook or Atlantic Tackle buffs and everything is, these are, are for sun protection too. They're not just a mask, although it works very conveniently for a mask, but they're designed for sun protection to wear when you're out off, offshore on the boat and everything. Guys have been wearing them for years, and yeah. now, now of course, we can't keep them in stock right. because everybody's utilizing them as uh, as face covering for the uh, for the COVID. But you know, who knew those guys were ahead of their time? That's right. Back then? Way like, ahead well, of why time. is that guy? Come on, and now it's like, hey, why does he not have one? Right. Way? Yeah. Fun, funny how times change. All right. So, how do people get in touch with the t staff here at Atlantic Tackle after hours, before hours? That's sort of thing. Uh, Leave a message. We're online at AtlanticTackle.com okay. or four one zero two one three. Zero four, zero two, four one. two one. Yeah, yep. see, Always get those numbers comes. backwards. Yeah, you want to say <laughs> yeah. one two three. Yep. Yeah, no zero four two one. We recommend you coming in here during hours, which will be soon enough. What? Uh, they'll be open seven to seven. Uh, should be by Father's Day weekend. We're we're just getting staff back sure. in the building. Uh, that's not the easiest thing to do. We're trying to roll with the punches of the uh, of the government. Uh, you know, conditions on opening and everything. So. By uh, by the time we get to Father's Day, we'll be back to seven to seven. Yeah, that's great. Happy Father's Day to all you folks out Happy there. Happy Father's you Day. You got loads of time to get over here to Atlantic Tackle. All right, this show will be airing all the way up until Father's Day and on Father's Day Sunday in the morning. So if you're watching on Father's Day, Happy Father's Day to you, Brian. Happy Father's Happy Day. Happy Father's Day to you. Fist pump from afar. Yeah. Guys, we'll be right back to finish out this show. We're joining Captain Mark Spagnola with Dust to Dawn bow fishing here at Hooked on OC. We'll be right back. See you in a second.